Well, last night I was talking about us being kind of anchored under a ridge of high pressure, and that's the case for us. We're seeing most of the dynamic systems well to the north where we've got jet stream support, so we get our wound up systems working across the northern tier or into Canada. We've got these little disturbances that drop out of the uh, uh, Aleutians and get into the Gulf of Alaska, so everything right now basically staying north of us. Now what we have out to the west of us is lower pressure, and then we're under a ridge of high pressure. And us being under that ridge now, it uh, a dome of high pressure, the circulation is starting at the top and it's clockwise down and around. So you get some compression in the atmosphere, that's mechanical heat. We flow warm moist air in from the Gulf, that's warm moist Gulf air. And you can see too as these systems move this way, this little band of cloudiness indicates that our dome of high pressure does take a hit from the west, northwest and northwest at times. And when it does that, we kind of put the squeeze on the atmosphere and we keep our winds quite gusty. This dome of high pressure that we're uh, uh, being influenced by in the Gulf and the Western Atlantic is a big, warm, slow moving system. So we can keep pretty good gusty winds in most of the time. So with this flow pattern, we get our morning clouds. They don't last too long. And once they're gone, the winds increase. We get south gusty winds and the temperature goes up. We had a lot of high temperatures out to the west of us. But like I say, our numbers didn't get quite up there. We had just enough moisture and a more moist atmosphere heats more slowly. A dry air will heat more rapidly, which we saw to the west of us. So not a great deal to show you in so far as uh, satellite or radar. It was just pretty nice. Temperature wise, we're still warm. We're in the 80s across the area. And you can see where the warmer numbers are out to the west of us. We saw some big numbers out there today, 105, 106 degrees. Lows tonight will be generally in the 70s across the area. Our winds have been coming at us now from the southeast. They're anywhere from about 10 to 20 miles per hour. They will die down somewhat tonight. So the gusts we're seeing again out west where it was a little more uh, warm. We've got uh, 20 to 25 mile per hour wind still gusting mainly west of us. We'll start in the morning around 70, go with some low clouds early, back to the sun, south and gusty winds, take it up to 96 average across the area. Areas west of us now will be hotter. And then we keep everything very much the same, not big changes. Dress for the weather, hat, sunglasses, light colored, loose fitting clothing, take occasional work and play breaks, stay hydrated, check on one another. Nothing live left in automobile, no pets, no plants, no people. So keep it safe with these numbers up like that. And we'll be back. After